Puerto Rico. Yeah, this is, um, this is horrible. It's been at least four months at this part, at, at this point where Puerto Rico has been without power, that they've suffered. Millions have died because of what happened in Puerto Rico. Now, it's not just that it was a, a natural catastrophe that happened. It's also that Donald Trump didn't do a single damn thing for two whole weeks. And then when he was there, he insulted everyone in Puerto Rico. He called them lazy. He said that they were ungrateful. And he constantly withheld support. And when they finally did get support, about a week later, he started thinking, hmm, you know, maybe we should cut that. The job of rebuilding Puerto Rico was given to a tiny, minuscule company that actually had two employees who had no experience in anything, but they knew someone who knew Donald Trump. And that's why they got the multi-million dollar contract. It is obscene that in this day and age, something is happening. And America is arguably the most wealthiest country on the planet, the most powerful country on the planet. And to this day, they still have no power. Power in this day and age is not a luxury. Power we need for hospitals. We need for homes. We need for education. There are so many things that have to be done and they are not being done because Donald Trump just doesn't care. Puerto Rico didn't vote for him. They didn't kiss his ass when he was there. So he doesn't care at all. And this is meant to be the leader of the free world. It's not good enough. Puerto Rico needs help. They need help today. Now, yes, uh, the army is there. And it's not helped by the fact that Puerto Rico's power system is apparently about 40 years old. And they, they have bits, but they have missing parts. And they might not be able to get these missing parts till February. It's just not good enough. So tweet the president, tweet the representatives if you're in America. Spread this message that Puerto Rico needs help.